Michelle. The awesome man behind my camera is Richard from Bentley's Backwoods Bushcraft. I am doing a Dollar Tree haul. Hopefully this doesn't get too long. It's um, a little bit of everything. Christmas gifts, stocking stuffers, food, and treats that I am going to make for uh, Christmas to give out in goodie bags that I'm sending to some people. So, <clears throat> I guess I'll start with the food so we can get the stuff in the freezer. They finally had our pop stickers back. We love these things. We got the chicken and veggie and the pork and veggie. These are so good. So good. But, um, uh, we, like, we'll go, both of these is like one serving. <laughs> yes. There's just not very many in there. And then, another item, I was gonna, I was gonna tell you guys, I kept my glasses for this reason, right here. Yeah, they're not very good for you. Well, a serving size is supposed to be three pieces, and there's supposed to be two servings, but, um, well, yeah, no. So I'm going to tell you that. We also found these spring rolls that we really like from Jennifer's Garden. Traditional vegetable spring rolls. We both really love these. And again, there's ten pieces, but they're really small, so needs to say they don't last long. Uh, and while you do that, I'm going to run these. Don't forget the buttons behind me. Hubby needed some more honey, so he got the high five. <clears throat> Did you push it already? No. I don't know if that worked. Tell me if it worked. Hold on, guys. Hashtag garage door problems. He's not saying anything, so I'm guessing that it worked. Um. So he bought this honey, it's high five honey. How many ounces is it? It is eight ounces. And it's in this cute little bear. How cute is he? It's not local honey, so it's really not the best honey for you. But, um, excuse me. <clears throat> It'll do for what he wants. And it, the taste is good, we've had it before. I also got four of the Rice Krispie Treats. These are actually, I'm going to cut them. I didn't take one. Cut them up probably into five pieces each and you... That's not number, gotta be four or six. It's five. The two together make ten, there you go. Um, dip them in the melted chocolate and then you sprinkle holiday, uh, you know, what's that called? Decor? Decor, holiday Cheer? cake decor on it. Holiday while the, cheer. While the chocolate is still, you know, chocolatey and soft. And it makes these cute little... Did you do this? I did not. It makes these cute little, you know, holiday treats. And you didn't have to spend two hours making the Rice Krispie Tree and then... Oh. <laughs> Alright guys, we'll be back in a minute. I'm going to have to pause for the grandson. Okay, sorry for the interruption. <laughs> Um, Seth, who lives in, our grandson who lives in Colorado, was trying to FaceTime us, and we don't generally just tell him no. Uh, we, we will answer when he calls because that's how we get to see him and, and Even talk if with we're him. busy. Even if we're busy. There's only been a few times where we've accidentally, or not accidentally, but absolutely just said, can't happen, call us in an hour, love you, bye. <laughs> so, anyway, uh, continuing with this haul, um, honey. Hide the doggie's eyes. She can't see this. Okay, she's not looking. She, is she hiding her yes, eyes? she is. She's hiding her eyes. Okay, she's, she's over there. Yes. Shh. Oh God, Violet. What? It's not for you. It's another dog. Look at those ears. You should show her. <laughs> Here's that. It's not for you. No. Uh-huh. Now, see, you even started it. Dang it. Okay. All right, well, it was supposed to be a Christmas present. It still can't be. It might not make it that long. She'll forget. <laughs> I know she won't. I have another Christmas present for her. There it is, in here somewhere. It is a, oh, I didn't even tell you what these were. <laughs> this is the gravy train, wavy bacon, great taste, dog snacks. We don't do snacks with her hardly ever because well, not she, dog snacks. 
Can I finish my sentence, People Mr. Snacks. Interruptus? Because she is constantly nibbling off of our food and plates anyway, so there's really not a reason to get her dog treats. I just thought it was something fun and different for Christmas. I found also these turkey, deli stick turkeys. Turkey for dogs, but it's like a beef jerky, but it's turkey. A turkey jerky. I was trying to see if I could smell it. Can't smell it. My dog's, my dog, my nose doesn't work like a dog's nose. So that's it for the, oh no, it's not either. I almost forgot the rest of the food. This is what happens when I get interrupted. Going along with the making treats for Christmas, we are also going to be, ah. I bought one pack of Oh, okay, different. I was like, what did I do? So, Hubby apparently got the Snyder's Sourdough um, Nibblers. Yes, I These love are one those. of his favorite treats. And then, <laughs> she's like, well, if you're not going to give me a treat, I'm just going to go get my food. And then I bought the mini pretzels. Uh, again, this is going to be part of that, you know, dip in chocolate sprinkles um, snack stuff for the tray. Hubby apparently got some corn chips as well. Love corn chips. Another one of his favorite faith faves. Now this one. Upside down. She hears the. Oh, she's at the door. Yeah, she I'll thinks she her. wants out. I think. I heard. Out. Yeah, Keith might have opened up the door up there. So anyway, um, hubby got some of his Mike and Ike's, too, as usual for him, because he likes those. Yeah, Keith's up there. And I think that is it for the food. Oh, light. I'm like, why does it look so dark? Now I know why. I forgot to turn the light back on. Oh, that air is cold. Wowzers. Ooh, doggy. Um, on to some of the fun stuff I found. I found one. One of these. I'm telling you, it's like a curse in that Dollar Tree. Find one of everything. Oh, I got it. I love the shape of these. I really wish I could have found about three, four, five, ten more. I would have bought at least four of these if I could have found them. So I found that. I was I was happy to find that. I did find some of the Jot Giant glue sticks. A lot of the crafters that I have been watching have been using this to put like the scrapbook paper onto things like this instead of the Mod Podge because it doesn't wrinkle as much. I would probably still have to do the Mod Podge because a lot of the stuff I make I anticipate it hanging on somebody's door or somewhere it could potentially get wet. I don't recommend hanging any of it like out on your front porch or anything like that but an in-between door it would work. Um, speaking of Mod Podge, I did buy some of the gloss Mod Podge, two bottles of it. There are two ounces in here. I love these because they're easy for me to handle and deal with when I'm crafting. I know it's not a great bargain. I actually had somebody comment on a video a very long time ago when I bought some of the smaller ones. You should just buy the big one and save your money. It's a better value and blah, 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 blah. I just felt like screaming at them because I'm like, you know, you don't know my life. Thank you for the suggestion, but stop You don't it. know me. You don't know me. I also went ahead and bought two more bottles of the matte. Uh, I have been going through this like crazy with all of the crafting I've been doing. Um, so I needed that. Another thing I needed for my crafting was a new pair of scissors. My scissors, I have tortured them. I've had them for, I don't know, four years maybe, maybe even longer. Um, and they're finally just now, and I think if I could run them through a sharpener, they would be fine. So I'm not throwing them away because I do want to try to sharpen them. But um, I've got so much wire and stuff with them that they're starting to get little nicky spots in them and they're not working so well. So I uh, was happy to find a good pair of the scissors. I can't, I still haven't found some like the ones that I have. These, these are the heavier duty ones. And I was trying to see, I thought it had a name on it somewhere, but I guess not. These bad boys have been awesome. Put those back. I also needed a red Sharpie and check that out. I found red Sharpies. I was so happy. So, so happy. Uh, I got these really cute little bowls. Um, gonna use these 
for the snacks that I make. Not the ones that I'm sending. I have something else for that that I'm excited to show you guys. But uh, 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 I can't get uh, um, the ones that I'm gonna keep here. I have a display in my head that I want to do, so I needed some Christmassy bowls. And my thought process was that mm, one bowl, because there's two to the set, right? Oh, these say peace on earth, and they have holly around them. So one is going to sit inside the lid like this, right? That's kind of cute, right? It puts a little scalloped edge. But then the other one can sit beside it like this and it'll have a little height to it. So it's like by level. I don't know. I could be way overthinking my goals here. I don't know. I don't know. I just want it to be pretty and fun and festive. <laughs> okay. Sorry. It went off on a roll. Speaking of pretty and fun and festive, I found this cute guy. It's got a bow on the top of it, but I don't know. And Hubby had to step out. This is see-through. The side is see-through. It says Merry Christmas on it, but it's see-through. This one's kind of a little bit jackied up. I'm going to have to do a little work to it and tape it. But it's all right. I can do that. I don't mind. It's not going anywhere. It's just for a little bit of family here. And I don't mind fixing that. But I love the red and white stripe and the bow. I thought that was really cute and would be fun for the foodie display. I keep bypassing these. I need to show you these before I lose them. They finally had these votives with the little pedestal, I guess, holder uh, for them. I have been looking for these for months. I know they made them in gold. I was really happy I found them in black. I only wanted two. Good. I got my two. I'm a happy camper. Obla dee, obla da. Sorry, I know it's like a deviation from what I was doing. This haul is so random. I feel so scattered. I cannot do this with any more hauls. I have got to organize my stuff. I wanted some fun plates for the next... I mean, these won't last very long. There's only, what, 10 in here? 18 in here? So they're not going to last very long with this because, you know, there's only 18 of them. But I liked the poinsettias on them, which is weird because I really don't like poinsettias. <laughs> like the plants. I don't know why, I just don't. I like that. I thought it was pretty. I also got some baking cups, aka cup cut holders. These are going to go, hold the phone, unbury it, inside this, which is a box. Cookie box. Cookie box. I'm not putting cookies mm -hmm. in it though. Mm -hmm. There's two in here. It's got the red truck on it. Turn it around so you can see the back of it. Really cute, right? It's adorable. But then I got these, because you sit these inside, and then you put your little treats in them. And then, depending, I don't know how deep these are. Let's find out. Shall we? Who does that on their videos? If you guys know who does that, I'll be so impressed. He'll say, um, let's go look inside and see what we can find. Shall we? If you guys know who that is, I'm so impressed with you right now. Don't even know. Oh, these are like perfect sized. Yes. Oh my gosh. So see, these are deep enough. I could probably do, well, maybe not two layers, but they're work. I'm not trying to feed the family for a week, right? I'm trying to give them a little snack, but check that out. That is, super oh, and it comes with, it's got little stickers, you guys, so you can seal the box shut. In that special. Oh, my Atlanta. It's a little truck. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. I'm totally in love with this right now. I'm not going to lie. That is super cool. Like I said, there's two in there. And there's, uh, yeah, that'll work perfectly. So, you know, I'm happy. Y'all have no idea how happy that just made me, how cute that was. Okay. I think that's it for the Christmas stuff. Like, Christmas stuff. Hubby loves these little lights. Ooh, that's very bright. <laughs> Hope I didn't just blind anybody. That is incredibly bright. Now these you just you squeeze them, right? Yep. Hit that other button on the other side. No, no, no. Yeah. That button? Yeah. Ah! And then you go. And charge it up. There you go. There that you is go. very, and then... it kind of lights up all charging. Can you guys see that it's lit up? And then you just 
push it back in. Push it in and slide that lock button back. it, and then you gotcha. can turn it on. I'm there you go. Really hard not to yeah. blind people, but that's pretty awesome, dude. No, no batteries. This would be a great man's stocking stuffer, and this was actually up in the stocking stuffer last minute, right? They call it the last minute buys. So they've yeah. got all this cute stuff. They've got a screwdriver set that I'm kind of regretting not grabbing, but oh well. That little small one, like um, I got the last last month. No, it's it's individual screwdrivers, oh, so the okay. tips don't come out because that's become oh. my pet peeve all of a okay. sudden. Um. I bought, not that we necessarily needed them, but it just seems like every time I go to buy these at the Dollar Tree, they don't have them. It's the two pack of a deck of cards for a dollar versus one deck of cards for a dollar. And these are actually really good cards. They're kind of small. They're a little on the small side, but they're really good cards. My mom is in a card club, so I'm actually going to donate this to the card club because they're constantly saying, we need new cards. Ta-da, card club cards. Probably should have got two of those too, but that's okay. Um, stocking stuffer again, um, more playing cards, but these are Star Wars playing cards. Rebels. Star Wars Rebels, yes. I should make sure to state that. Uh, deck of cards, and these are going to go for Michael and one for Jaden. And Butthead Man behind the camera kept showing Jaden everything that we were finding, including these role-playing dice sets. There's a red set as well. Jaden took it with him. It's a red set right there, isn't it? Oh, it is red. What one did he take with him? Uh, there's an orange one. So there was a the purple orange. one. A oh, purple. He said he got one of each color. I only see. Is it eight o'clock? Is it seriously eight o'clock? It is, dude. It was just six o'clock. What happened to seven o'clock? Med's time. Med's time. But anyway, so these are going to go in Jaden's stocking, even though he knows he's getting them. I don't care. They're going in his stocking. That was my plan, and I'm sticking to it, and everybody else can just bite my booty. He also wanted some um, sharpener and eraser little kits. Got him those. And I think that's all for him. More stocking stuffers that I got for uh, Spencer and Patrick. A couple of Hot Wheels cars at the Dollar Tree. These are overwatch i don't know what that is it just looked kind of cool versus the standard old you know hot wheels car it's kind of big and beefy and chunky so liked that found this um it's a mint uh macaron lip balm i actually bought this for a purpose i hope i get to use it for the reason i bought it i've got to do our budget and see if i can swing this one item that i desperate to buy I'm not gonna talk about it otherwise because if I can't I'll just use it because it is a lip balm and my lips are horrible right now another gift this is actually a gift he knows I bought it Jane's sitting there telling me how he wants to start doing crossword puzzles and what do I find a colossal crossword puzzle are you stinking kidding me and he said there are well he said there's like over 300 I don't know where he got his info because I'm not seeing anywhere on here where it says 300. Anyway, it's like over three feet wide though. It's a poster. Whoa. It's a poster. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's one of his gifts. Hubby, of course, had to get some paracord because, you know, the big box that he's got out in the garage isn't full enough yet. Ugh, silly man. And, shocker. Guess what else he found? He found movies. My husband got movies. What the heck? Clash of the Empires and um, Marintel. I have no idea. Martial art movies. Martial art movies. Yep. Yeah, that's all we need to say. And last, but what are you doing? Really? Come on, B. I'm not sure what she was trying to do. There's no space back here behind me or under me, and she was all up in my business. I got a doggy bandana. Oh, hold on. For? Not for her. Okay. He down. hates when we put stuff on her. Um, I actually got this for some crafting ideas because I like the buffalo check pattern. The largest one I could find was this one. They had some smaller ones, but obviously, you know, for a dollar, I want as much fabric as I could get. So that is the Dollar Tree. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't know why I thought of that, but I did. 
Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for sharing this little bit of time with me, and I hope you guys are having a van, van, a fantastic a day, fantastic a day. fantastic day, and a wonderful holiday. I'll see you guys later. Bye.